there was wild jubilation in Liberia by supporters of George Weah as provisional results from Tuesday's presidential runoff polls in the country have placed former international football superstar far ahead with 61.5% of votes so far processed. His rival and incumbent vice president, Joseph Bokai, is trailing behind with 38.5 per century. So far, 1,176,203 votes representing 98.1% of the total 1,198,984 votes cast in the runoff polls have been announced. Chairman of the National Elections Commission, NEC, Mr. Jerome Corcoya, released the provisional results at the Commission's headquarters in Monrovia on Thursday. According to Corcoya, 100 per center vote processing has been recorded in 11 out of the 15 counties in the country. In all, WIA has swept 14 counties, leaving only one for Bokai. The former FIFA World Footballer of the Year has won in Gbarpolo, Grand Bassa, Grand Cape Mount, Grand Cru, Maryland, Monserrato, River Cess, River G, and Sino counties. The vice president won in only Lafa County with 78,140 votes representing 84.1% as against WIA as 14,789 votes or 15.9 per century. The announcement by the NEC chairman sparked wild jubilation by youths across the streets of the capital. Peter Colley, 25, a commercial motorcyclist, said it was a new dawn for Liberian youths. Our suffering and neglect by the ruling class is over. Wea is coming to change Liberia for the youths. It's a great day for my country, he said. The announcement of results was witnessed by head of the ECOWAS Elections Observation Mission and former president of Ghana, Mr. John Mahama. Wea, 51, will take over from outgoing President Alan Johnson Sirleaf, whose 12-year tenure ends in January. This will be the first democratic transition of power since 1944 in a country devastated by decades of civil war.